guys welcome to a feminine touch if this is your first time here welcome and i hope you're gonna remain a doll but if this is not welcome back my dolls how is everyone doing this new year this new year like i said in my previous episode is just amazing and the things that has been happening like the manifestations and everything has just been absolutely amazing and I want to talk about confidence because the craziest thing happened to me recently and it just made me realize oh my god this is like I wasn't this confident before and I'm literally feeling students and getting compliments about how confident I am this is something I need to talk on like what did I do differently and then I kind of like went back and saw the things I did and I have decided to let you dolls in on my little secret so if you're interested in this stay tuned so what is confidence and um, confidence is literally the feeling or belief that one can have faith in or rely on someone or something and it's also the feeling of self-assurance arising from an appreciation of one's own abilities or qualities this i got from google and yeah it's literally just having belief and trust and self-insurance in yourself or someone else and this is how to have confidence in yourself one thing i was realizing when i was thinking back is i realized that i have always been a confident child and that is because of i just so lucky so blessed to have amazing supportive parents and friends around me who kind of always hyped me up like i remember my mom just telling me how amazing and beautiful i am and my dad always like spoiling me and just you know just telling me how amazing wonderful confident how i'm that girl you know just put it in words like i like to say like words of assurance in me and that really really helped me and I just realized that not everyone can have the opportunity of having you know amazing parents like like mine and that made me think and just realizing that it's because of the, the words that were said by my parents to me that made me feel confident and if you don't have that you can start affirming because i have been confident in doing some things because i've been told oh you're great at this so i was great at that but when i was told oh you know you're terrible at this like don't even think about doing this i lost all my confidence of course so i thought about but this is something i really want to do and this is something i want to be confident in how can i assure myself that it's something i can do and that's where affirming comes in i just love the act of affirmation it's truly everything and looking back that's kind of the same thing my parents were doing kind of like affirming for me so if you don't have like parents or friends do it for yourself because i've done it for myself for some things and it has just worked wonders i can't even explain to you how amazing affirming is there are different ways you can affirm i'm just gonna tell you a few ways that i personally have affirmed and that has worked for me the first thing is journaling i always write down all my affirmations every single day in my journal every single day i say i'm confident i money comes to me easily people love me i'm that girl everything that i'm trying to like attract in my life i keep them writing i keep writing them down every single day and the act of writing because you're like when you're writing you're also like your conscious mind is seeing it and it's going into your subconscious mind the more you write it every single day the more the belief starts to happen and starts to grow so you keep on seeing that you're writing i am confident i am confident i am confident i am confident your brain is going to start believing that because you keep on writing and keep on telling yourself that every single day with also journaling i love doing visualization techniques because this also works wonders this kind of also brings in the feeling of that confidence so for instance you 
if you have time i do this for one hour because i do have the time if you don't have the time you can do this for five minutes ten minutes it depends but just like sit down and just imagine how it will feel and what is going to happen when you're confident so for instance you just visualize other people stopping you to say oh my god hi i just love your aura i love your confidence i think you're so confident i love how you show up i love how you walk i love your hair today you know if you're at work if you're in class you're in school you're shopping you just have like people stopping you to just tell you how amazing you are so visualize that and visualize how you're gonna feel just say hi hello oh my god i love your hair i love your dress where did you get that from i love what you're wearing i like how you move i love your demeanor you know just like how you're gonna feel when other people compliment you so if you can do that for i do it for one hour honestly the longer the better but if you can do that for any amount of time to just like start telling your subconscious this is the new normal this is the new feeling and you tapping into that feeling of being confident is just gonna honestly change your life you're gonna start actually being stopped by people and i'm gonna give you a story about this soon but i just want to tell you another affirming technique i've used and it's mirror work like self-talk you look at yourself in the mirror and just say i am confident like look at yourself dead in the eyes and just say i am confident i am confident i am confident i am confident or you can say you are confident you are confident or you can use your name and just say for instance merlin is confident merlin is confident you know anyone that works for you for some things i know that i love the you are you are it kind of resonates with me and for some other things i like the i am i am so think about what really works for you and then just keep doing that and this is also something i have like like i said like me just being so confident right now and just feeling like everything is possible these are the things that i did and recently i went to watch um, mean girls oh my god have you guys watched mean girls it was so interesting it was fun it's a musical i kind of liked it it was cool um but i went to watch mean girls alone by myself and i remember like being in the uber and the guy was just like oh wow there's something about you you're really confident and i was like oh thank you like what made you say so and he's like oh i don't know the way you just carry yourself like your demeanor you just like can i ask where are you going to i was like oh i'm going to the movies i'm gonna watch this movie by myself it's something i've been wanting to watch for a long time and then he was like oh are you gonna meet your friends there i was like no i'm doing it by myself he was like see i knew you were confident <laughs> and then i'm like oh why do you say so he's like you're just going to see a movie by yourself like that's something i could never do i always feel like i need to have people around me in company like i'm so envious of you right now you do what you say you're gonna do and you're just like not caring about what other people think you're just doing whatever you're doing and i love that and i was like oh thank you so much like that like that really made me feel so amazing like honestly it just like skyrocket my confidence times 100 and these are some visualization techniques that i did like people just saying how they can feel the confidence through my skin like oozing out of my pores and this is exactly what happened <laughs> like i was like so shocked i was like oh my god this I mean i know it works but i was just like wow this really truly works like affirming really goes a long way and the more consistent you are the more you're really gonna start believing that you are confident or whatever it is you want to believe so another way to um build your confidence is to show up for yourself I cannot stress like I feel like I always say I cannot stress but like it's because all these things work it works my dolls it does you need to show up for yourself if you're the kind of person who says oh you know this on Monday I'm gonna start working out or I'm gonna start eating healthy or I'm gonna start you know t putting things back where I found them so I don't have a disorganized house or room or whatever and you 
don't do that you're not gonna be confident you're not gonna feel like you're worthy and you're deserving because your mind is seeing your mind is with you your eyes are with you everything is connected when you tell yourself oh today i'm gonna do that and you don't do that today you just you just like reaffirming to yourself that oh i'm not worth it i'm not deserving i'm not a woman of her words you know i say things and i don't show up for myself you know it just really chips at your confidence and i'm gonna give you a story for me this was pilates say i used to say oh i'm gonna do pilates today and then i'll wake up and i'm like oh god i'm so tired like there is no way i'm doing pilates today and then i never do pilates and then i just end the day feeling so bad that oh my god you did it again you said you were gonna do it and you didn't do it okay 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 we'll do it tomorrow tomorrow comes i don't do it you know and just that kind of just makes you feel very bad about yourself you know that doesn't help with any confidence boosting so i really just sat myself down and i was like listen you have a goal you want to do pilates because you want to start moving your body you want to get this dream body you're not showing up for yourself how do you expect to get this dream body if you're not doing the thing you know like just do it you know i really had to give myself that pep talk of like be freaking for real <laughs> like bffr what are you doing and then i said okay how can i make this easy because i started realizing that me doing the pilates for one hour was kind of really overwhelming i think just the thought of like doing it for one hour just made me not want to do it so i was like okay how can i make this easy for myself and i kid you not i started doing it for like five minutes every single day in my pjs so once i woke up so to make, like i said to make it easy for me so once i wake up whatever i'm wearing whatever i went to bed with i'm gonna do it for i'm gonna just go on youtube type out pilates um session for five minutes do it for five minutes in my pjs and honestly just doing that and trying to like be consistent every single day like that made the whole difference and then from doing it for five minutes i started doing it for 10 and started doing it for 20 now i can go like one hour plus doing pilates i'm not even feeling anything i'm like oh oh this was one hour interesting and then also like after doing it for five ten thirty minutes and i realized now i have built that momentum of being consistent because now i'm like shortening it and now i can show up for myself for 30 minutes me just building that momentum really helped and then i was like okay how can i make this even more fun and then i love pink personally so i went to like get a pink pilates mat pink um weight lift and then pink mini balls pink workout sets to make it look so cute so i wake up in the morning i'm like so excited to wear my pink workout sets and use my pink mats and then that made it even more fun for me and then doing it for like 30 minutes 20 minutes 40 minutes and now like it's a habit like i can't even like every time i wake up in my bed i'm putting on my workout set i'm doing my pilates you know now it's a thing it's like i can't even imagine not doing it you know so if you want to start doing something you want to start showing up for yourself to feel that confidence try and chip it down a little bit like don't overwhelm yourself and saying oh i have to do this for one hour because trust me you're not even gonna do it so if you can like reduce it and say okay we're just gonna do it for five minutes we're gonna do it for two minutes three minutes as small as you can chop it down to do that and then keep on showing up for yourself every single time and my dolls i kid you not you're just gonna be shocked about how you feel especially how you start your day like starting the, your morning routine is really essential because at that time you have like built your confidence you have journaled you've said your affirmations you're doing your pilates you're gonna go through the whole day feeling so confident because you showed up for yourself what you said you were gonna do you did so you're gonna just show up even more confident more worthy and more deserving so showing up for yourself is a big part in building your confidence another way to build your confidence is to celebrate your smallest wins 
like once you're started like showing up for yourself start celebrating that be so happy like write out write that down in your journal oh my god diary i worked out for five minutes today i feel absolutely amazing like you can even joke for yourself like oh my god i can even see the abs coming in you know like just the little cute things like oh i did this today let me just reward myself with this like get yourself something nice you know light that nice candle as a celebration wear that nice dress as a celebration go to that restaurant you've always wanted to go to you know just do like celebrate the smallest thing and if it's you just waking up today say oh my god i can't believe you woke up today oh my god i'm back girl (laughs) you know and just like be so happy like call your friends oh my god i can't believe i did this today like celebrate the small things make the smallest thing you do make it a big thing like it's like oh you just oh you just worked out for three minutes and you're this happy it's like yeah i celebrate my small wins be proud of yourself be like put your like put in your best dress your best perfume and be like yes i worked out today i'm so happy I, i'm the kind of woman who shows up for herself i love myself you know just in that self-love feeling i feel like that also like goes back to self-love like once you really feel love for yourself and you can see that you're really showing up for yourself and you're celebrating yourself oh my god your confidence is gonna like skyrocket because it's like yeah you celebrate yourself other people want to celebrate you too because do not forget my dolls how you treat yourself is how other people treat you too if people see that oh she's the kind of girl who celebrates herself she buys herself nice things she does this for herself she always looks good they know already who you are and how you treat yourself and how much you love yourself so they're gonna obviously come correct and if they cannot come correct not supposed to be in your vibration you're not supposed to be in your energy because you're not even worth it you know you are worthy you hold yourself to certain standards and you show up for yourself so yeah if you cannot throw up if you cannot do the same things you're doing for them this also goes back to like dating and like relationships even friendships like i honestly cannot be with people who feel so insecure about themselves because i feel like i feel like i'm that girl a hundred percent you know so if someone is here doing the smallest thing saying oh my god i'm so stupid or just like having negative self talk with themselves like i can't even be around that person because i don't talk to myself that way and it makes me feel a certain way when i hear other people talking to themselves that way and i don't want to be around that kind of energy so i'm not even you know like participating in that so really hold yourself to this standard of like you know what i'm that kind of girl i do this i show up for myself i love myself and people are gonna see it and people are gonna treat you the absolute same this is why like having confidence is absolutely amazing this is why i love being confident because when you just show up and you're confident and you don't care other people know they can see it they can smell it on you and they know how to treat you better like you have the princess treatment that we all want because you're confident they know that oh she gives herself this princess treatment I know better than to come correct. I also have to give her this princess treatment or else she's not even gonna answer me or give me the light of day. And that's what I love. I feel like people can see this. So celebrate yourself, just do it, show for yourself, affirm and just see your life change. Like I cannot tell you how being confident and truly being confident in, not really just being confident, like being confident even in my flaws. You know, I know that, oh, maybe my hair can come out great today, but that's not going to stop me because I still know that I still show up for myself today. I'm still that girl. I'm still an amazing person. Even if I made this mistake, I'm still that girl, you know? So even being confident in your wins and your mistakes, because I don't, we don't do failure around here. There's no such thing. They're just mistakes and they're just redirection to your actual win. So even feeling amazing and confident if there's some pilates moves that i do and i'm like oh my god like i fall down or i don't get it at first it doesn't make me even feel bad i'm like even more confident because i even tried to do that move some people will just see and be like oh please i'm not doing this i even tried to do that so 
me falling down is not even me failing it's me just making a mistake and now i know what i did wrong and what to improve and then next week i'm doing the move no hassle you know so i kind of uh, like try the things just do it affirm visualize show up for yourself celebrate your small wins and just see your entire life change my dolls my god i had so much fun making this episode and i just want to also say dolls we are on the road to one thousand subscribers like i still can't even believe i have like 900 of you here i feel so grateful and so blessed i can't believe you guys comment i see your comments your likes your shares you guys that share i love you so much thanks for sharing and oh my god you dolls are really the best the best 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 ever we are going to 1k so please share this video comments likes because it also helps with the algorithm and do not forget to have a feminine touch in every single thing you do Mwah!